what's up with it guys welcome back to another video in today's video we're going to be doing a little review on this beauty right here we have the bmw m6 we're going to start by doing a walk around if you're new to the channel go ahead and give me a thumbs up comment down below what you think about the video if you've been in the market for a bmw m6 uh what model you're looking for what specs you're looking for this one happens to be a convertible black rims blue calibers fully loaded uh fully loaded let me see if we can get the headlights but we got a little something going with the headlights but i do like the grill on it um y'all know i like i like uh red but it does come with those blue blue big big brakes up front too big brakes up front so i like those black wheels when they clean they're gonna look good shout out my boy mike g 119 on instagram he got that uh m6 first uh m6 i ever rode in was with, was with him quad exhaust back here very aggressive i think this flips out yeah so this flips out I don't know if I'm doing this right, but. Oh no, is that the camera? Oh yeah, I think that's the camera up under there. Let me know if I'm doing that right, but. I think when you put it in reverse, that lifts up or something, I don't know, but. Yeah guys, overall, this is a, a, a special car. Um, it, it's not as aggressive as I want it to be, but for some of you out there, this may be just enough. I mean, it's expensive, it's luxury, it has everything it has room it got like everything you could you, you possibly probably need in a car so oh, that's enough talking guys i'm gonna do one more walk around and then we'll dive into the interior and see what's going on so yeah we're gonna do one more quick walk around as you can see she kind of dirty right now but i like that you got the side gear you got that side gear see. oh no that didn't light up but i know it light up when the turn signal and i like all of that man Black wheels, blue calipers with the M on the caliper. The M on the caliper like that. The headlights, the kidney grill all up front. Need a front splitter, make it a little bit more aggressive. It's just a nice car, like Michelin. Pilot Super Sports. Dealer warranty on it. I don't know guys see i'm still on the hunt for my new car like right, they totaled out my c7 i don't know what i'm gonna get yet i saw a zl1 it's manual i want automatic i don't got time to be shifting all them gears i already got the slingshot that's manual so this one man let's just let's just dive into the interior so i can show y'all here go the key right here we open the door you greet it by all oh, that carbon fiber all in the door jam. Black. Bang and Olsen. Bang and Olsen sound system. Oh, it smells good in here too. M6 all on the door seal. Look at all that carbon fiber, boy. All that carbon fiber up in there, boy, 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 boy. Oh man, you got lights lights on auto and what you guys doing up here you want them lights on auto oh man i like the seats how they wrap around you see the hold on let me see if i can show y'all how far how you just in the seat like i like the cockpit view Yo. oh oh Oh, okay, okay, let me get in. <laughs> so you shut the door right here. See, they parking the Tesla over there now, so. You shut the door right there. Let me see. You got the seat right here. Oh, you got a little windscreen right there. Man, this is, this is it. Dual clutch transmission. Oh, you don't even know how to shift gears up in this boy. You got to take a whole lesson just to learn how to shift the gears. Beautiful transmission though. When my boy Mike, he drove me 
the, the transmission is extremely smooth. Um, the steering wheel, paddle shifter, so if you want to have a little bit of fun. Um, all your steering wheel controls, volume up, volume down, telephone, Apple CarPlay, or um, whatever, voice commands, all of that. 200, 200 on the dash. But all right, guys, let's go ahead and listen to this start up from the inside. Let's go ahead and get this bad boy started up. Foot on the brake button. crazy like my whole seat is adjusting because i'm in guest mode now oh yeah this is this is top notch like this is you got something special you driving look oh did i'm not sure if y'all saw but the speaker raised up when i um when the sound system came on the speaker just raised up like that so yeah guys like so far y'all let me know what y'all think about this one it is an $85,000 car, like used, brand new. You're probably looking at 125. Correct me if I'm wrong, but this is definitely like a, a $80,000 car um, used. So, I mean, this one may be a little bit more. It only has 12,000 miles. We just gonna say 12,000 miles. Um, so yeah, like this is the convertible model. So let's see if uh, we could have him drop the top for us how do you drop the top in this car oh right here you press the button right here i like that you got the key right here to get all this lot let's see what storage is looking like oh yeah i could fit oh yeah you can fit it let me see let me show you guys the depth show you guys the depth of the glove compartment captain seat so it only seats four yeah guys this is it this is top notch but let's see how that top you got over here you got a little cigarette little cigarette compartment cigarette lighter oh no i didn't cigarette lighter but car charger whatever uh what's over here glove box headlights uh obd2 port let's see what's in the trunk though guys so so far we got a good look at the interior interior is based it's black on black with the blue calipers i know you like that now let's check out the trunk but they do just park the tesla right here like i did a, a a little video on that one not too long ago let's check out this trunk here. is the trunk not open Okay, the trunk was just heavy. It act like it didn't want to open. But yeah, I mean, a decent amount, of, decent amount of space back here. Not too much, but not too little. Just enough. You, I would say you could probably fit two, one suitcase, one suitcase, or one, and then one right there. Little bags on the side right here. But she has a quiet idle. Let me see. Y'all. See if we can get this top down. Okay. All right, let's see. Press this thing. Oh, snap is doing something. Oh, snap is doing something. Oh, snap. Oh, snap. picked it up for you guys but now we in here with the roof off oh man 
that just changed the whole experience. Let me get y'all one more. Check the lamps out. Where the light at? Okay, the light is right there. Okay, good, good, though. All right, let me get y'all one more walk around with that top off, though. Like, you take the tops off, bro. You doing it. See how that see how the screen just block all the wind from right here but the back seats do look big enough for two full-size adults if you need the room like in my mustang over there see so in my mustang over there no way uh two full-size adults they can fit but the ride is going to be extremely uncomfortable in this car at least it looks like it's going to be somewhat comfortable but Look at all that interior, big old infotainment system right there. Oh, uh, well, yeah, I like the headlights on it. Show you all that top down one more time. M6. So let's go back inside one more time. Take a look at the infotainment system. Let's see. Let's see. So you got a message right there once you leave with the key. You get the navigation system. Beautiful. Menu, music, phone, navigation. BMW hit the nail on the head with this car. It is like it's just it is what it is like it's just something special man. make me want to get one but I'm, I'm really just trying to be patient and wait for my c8 i just really want to be patient and wait for the c8 guys but y'all comment below let me know if you think this is something that maybe i should invest in if you think it's wise if you don't think it's wise if they always lose value, if they maintain their value, this is a BMW M6, 2018, 12,000 miles. I don't know guys, I gotta go to sleep on this one, but the video was definitely worth it. Let me see if I can get y'all some revs. She quiet, but my boy Mike's here is loud. Make sure y'all go check him out on IG. Oh, look at all that carbon fiber up in there. Paddle shifters plus down. And the only thing I think is missing to be uh, more, you need, I want, let me see, what's over here? Steering wheel. Oh, yeah, steering wheel, sport plus, uh, traction control. What's this? Or I think, I don't know what, that might be Sport Plus, that might be for the rev limiter. I think that's for revving. What is this? Oh, that's handling. That must be suspension. Steering, suspension, and rev. I got all of that on Sport Plus. Oh yeah, you can see it right here. Sport Plus for everything. I just wish that it all changed. So as you change each mode, the whole dash changed, just like in my C7. I think that would have been a cool touch. But then again, it's BMW. They want to stand out. You see the little car over there with the door open. I shut the door. It goes away. And the door is so solid, too. Like, the door is real solid. It was just a well-made car. But all right, guys. We're going to see if we can take it for a spin. We'll see what happens. Uh, if not, we'll just go ahead and call it a day. But yeah, guys, this one might have to be it. I don't know. We'll see what happens. I didn't see myself getting the M6, but nice one right here. And I may have forgotten this, but you got a little bit of space down here too. Like you could put your wallet down there. You can put, let me see. You got it on this side too. A little net 
it down here. It's just a nice car. But all right, guys, I'll get right back to you. So that, this concludes that video. I know y'all just saw the top mechanism folding the little trunk go that way and then the top go down, come back up. I know it's nice. Y'all comment below that. Let me know what you think about this car. Let me know if it's worth 70 grand. Um, if you think it's a good deal. If you don't think it's a good deal. Uh, if, if you found this video informative, give it a big thumbs up. If you didn't like the video, go ahead and give it a dislike. Uh, I'll see all you guys at the top. Go to the website, brickbybrick.store. Support your boys' clothing brand, all of that. Actually, we have more coming than just clothes, though. Check it out. Anything else you want to say? What you want, what you want to say to them about the car? What you think about the BMW M6? It's a real nice car to me. Okay. What's nice about it, though? The look and all. Uh... Uh, the features on it. All oh, the features on it. Very tight, futuristic. It's only 2018. Like I said, I pointed out all the flaws in it, but I pointed out everything that I love about the car too. The infotainment system, the layout, the gadgets, the paddle shifter, the whole experience just from when you open the door all the way down to the key. Now, they could have done a little bit better with the key, but besides that, it's still, I don't, guys, I think it's worth it. But then again, I'm like in my 20s. I think I want something a little bit more like Corvette type. This more 40, 50 year old dude or 40, 50 older people. I don't know. To me, I just think I fit. To me, I'm not even going to get into all, all the age range and all that. I just think that maybe I fit the vet a little bit better than I fit this car. But then again, I do like this one. This one is this one's sweet. So yeah, guys, y'all comment below. Let me know what y'all think about it. Um, tell them go to the website. Go to the Brick by Brick website. Make sure you heard them. Go ahead and hit the hit up the website, guys. I will catch you in the next video.